What's going on, everyone? ChristianPickDogs.com here with your free pick in the New Hampshire versus Stonehill college basketball matchup going down Monday, December 11th, 2023. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games I love the most, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. But let's get to this one between New Hampshire and Stonehill. And New Hampshire coming into this one with a record of 6-4 and four on the year after a 76-64 road loss at the hands of Dartmouth in their last matchup. Meanwhile, Stonehill coming into this game with a record of 1-10 on the year, 9 straight losses following a 73-56 loss on the road at the hands of Ryder in their last matchup. Now, Stonehill was a nice story last season. I mean, it, it was their debut season in Division One. You know, they had a decent 14-17 and 17 record, managed to win 10 games in NEC conference play. And I'm sure maybe though once we get into NEC conference play, they can have a little bit more success than they've had so far this season. The problem for uh, for uh, for Stonehill is that right now they're not there and they're really struggling on the road for much of the season. You know, losses to UConn and Kentucky and St. Joe's probably to be expected, but not in the fashion that Stonehill lost or that you'd hope that they would lose in. You know, they lost by 34 at Kentucky, 40 at UConn, 44 at St. Joseph's, giving up 100 plus in all those games. They were they were more than doubled up by George Washington in their debut this season. Lost that game 89 to 44 on the road. Also lost by 11 points at te uh, Texas A&M Commerce in Quinnipiac, and uh, 17 plus against Ryder and Stony Brook. So it's just all bad for Stonehill right now. They're not hitting the glass hard. They're 346th in offensive rebounding percentage. They're 242nd in three point shooting. 307th in two-point shooting, 343rd in adjusted offensive efficiency. Like I said, it is just a lot of bad for Stonehill, and it's even worse on defense. 354th in defensive efficiency, 342nd in effective field goal percentage. They are allowing teams to knock down a lot of shots. 334th in three-point defense and 306th in two-point defense as well. So like I said, for Stonehill, just really not coming together. New Hampshire on the other side, well, the Wildcats are just playing a lot better. You know, and you know, while they have had some close games against teams like Marist and Columbia, they've done a good job beating up on solid teams like Brown, and you know, they've gotten some road wins as well. And for me right now, New Hampshire's just simply the lesser of two evils. Are they great at you know three point shooting? No, they're around you know the middle of the pack offensively. Um, 200th nationally, they're 219th in adjusted offensive efficiency. They're shooting 71% from the foul line. But again, Stonehill has had a tendency to make teams look a lot better than they, they might be, especially when they go to visit their building. I think New Hampshire, like I said, it's the lesser of two evils here, taking New Hampshire to win this one by 15 plus. So I'm going to take New Hampshire. I'm going to lay the big number. Like I said, there's just no back in Stonehill in this spot. That's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're at Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here at Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.